This video is going to demonstrate how to create a list in Digo. In your library, you're going to want to scroll down. On the left hand side, you're going to see something that says lists. At the bottom, it says create new list. I'm going to click that. I'm going to give it a title. I'm just going to call it Social Studies and Maps. As you see, it creates a custom URL or address for the students to find. Select a category, Schools and Education, Keywords, and give it a description. and then I'm going to click Create List. And at this point, you see there's nothing in my list, so I'll have to bookmark things. I have a permalink here. If I click that, it's going to give me the exact web, web address that I can put in Moodle or give to my students. I also can go, can go in and edit. I'm going to click Edit. That will bring me back to this page. I want to change one thing and click the beginning of the list. Every time I bookmark and add something to the list, I want it always to appear at the top. I'm going to click Save Changes. And now I'm just going to go search for something to bookmark. Let's just say National Geographic. I'm going to go ahead and bookmark this by simply clicking bookmark. Uh, just by calling additional map resources and see maps. I'm going to call it social. and chapter 4. So I've tagged it with three specific things geography, uh, magazine, then I'm going to click more options, add to a list, and there's my list, social studies and maps, click save, and now it's been added to my list. How do you find those lists? I simply click Digo, my lists, then I can go and find the list I just created. This was how to create a list in Digo.